with some overnight developments in that shooting of two officers near a college campus in Georgia. The alleged shooter is on the run and the focus of an intense manhunt. NBC's Kerry Sanders has the latest on this. Hi, Kerry. Good morning. Well, good morning, Matt. The authorities have established a dragnet in this area. They say the semi-rural area may have lots of places to hide, but with daylight, they are confident they will be able to find this man who they're accusing of shooting and killing one police officer and seriously wounding another. This morning, the search for a gunman in southern Georgia intensifies. The suspect, Minquel Lembrick, considered armed and dangerous, accused of shooting two officers, killing one and critically injuring the other. Overnight, officials raised the reward for his arrest to $50,000, just hours after asking Lembrick to turn himself in. Everyone's safety is important. Contact us to end this in a peaceful manner. We want the violence to end today. Outside the police station last night, community members gathered to mourn Officer Nicholas Ryan Smarr, a four-year veteran of the America's police force, who was fatally shot. They also prayed for Officer Jody Smith with the Georgia Southwestern University Police. Officials say he's out of surgery, his condition this morning unknown. The manhunt began Wednesday morning when the two officers responded to a domestic disturbance call. Shots were fired, the officers hit, and Lembrick took off. The nearby Georgia Southwestern University put on lockdown, and students asked to stay indoors overnight. This is a very dangerous individual. We need to have him off the streets. Police say Lembrick is also wanted on kidnapping and other charges. This morning, more than 200 officers across different agencies are joining the search. It's a tragedy beyond words. It's one of our family members is has been taken from us. School buses are out this morning. Parents are being urged by lawmen that if their children wait at the bus stop because this man is considered armed and dangerous, they either accompany their children to the bus stop waiting for the bus to pick them up or take them to school themselves. Tamara and Matt. Uh, Kerry Sanders on this story. Kerry, thank you. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.